New tonight, injury remains the number one cause of death among Indiana children. This comes as the state struggles to lower the number of kids dying from abuse and neglect. As CBS 4 Hannah Adamson explains, that number has remained the same for several years. The findings were eye-opening. State Representative Vanessa Summers is part of a legislative committee looking into issues surrounding child services. She says she was shocked by two new child fatality reports from the Indiana Department of Child Services and the Indiana Department of Health. We don't have the manpower of people to take care of those children when they're in a vulnerable and dangerous situation. The Indiana DCS says from 2016 to 2022, the state saw an average of 60 deaths each year as a result of child abuse or neglect. The first area of concern was that it's just taking too long for us to get data. Braylynn Yarrington with Champions for Children Indiana says she's concerned too many calls to Indiana's child abuse and neglect hotline go unheeded. A lot of these kids had previous substantiated or unsubstantiated assessments. That means there were investigations prior to that fatality. A separate report from the Indiana Department of Health states from 2007 to 2022, roughly 4,400 kids were fatally injured, making injury the number one cause of death among Indiana kids. The report goes on to say, quote, Every four minutes, a child is treated for an injury in an emergency room in Indiana. We're really not improving. I, it just made me very concerned. That tells me that we're not doing enough. State Representative Summer says most of the bills she plans to introduce next session pertain to child and family issues. But it's unclear how many more dollars could go into fighting child mortality rates as lawmakers prepare for the next budget cycle. Of course, that leads to needing more money in those areas if we want to be able to help those children. Now, in the next legislative session, I don't know what that looks like. We did reach out to both the Indiana Department of Child Services and the Department of Health for comment. We have yet to hear back. Reporting from the State House, I'm Hannah Adamson. Next at five.